Good morning to you on this Tuesday 6th of December 2022. My name is Reverend Jo Richards, Rector here in Canterbury of St Dunstan, St Mildred's and St Peter's. And lovely that you have joined us today for morning prayer. And today we remember St Nicholas, Bishop of Myra in 326. So as we begin our worship together, O Lord, open our lips and our mouth shall proclaim your praise. Reveal among us the light of your presence, that we may behold your power and glory. Blessed are you, sovereign God of all, to you be praise and glory for ever. In your tender compassion, the dawn from on high is breaking upon us, to dispel the lingering shadows of night. As we look for your coming amongst us this day, open our eyes to behold your presence, and strengthen our hands to do your will that the world may rejoice and give you praise. Blessed be God, Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Blessed be God forever. The night has passed and the day lies open before us. Let us pray with one heart and mind. As we rejoice in the gift of this new day, so may the light of your presence, O God, set our hearts on fire with love for you, now and forever. Amen. We say together Psalm or say uh, the Psalm 56, which is the appointed psalm for today. In God I trust and will not fear. Have mercy on me, O God, for they trample over me. All day long they assault and oppress me. My adversaries trample over me all the day long. Many are they that make proud war against me. In the day of my fear I put my trust in you. In God, whose word I praise. In God I trust and will not fear, for what can flesh do to me? All day long they wound me with words, their every thought is to do me evil. They stir up trouble, they lie in wait, marking my steps, they seek my life. Shall they escape for all their wickedness? In anger, O God, cast the peoples down. You have counted up my groaning, put my tears into your bottle. Are they not written in your book? Then shall my enemies turn back on the day when I call upon you. This I know, for God is on my side. In God whose word I praise, in the Lord whose word I praise, in God I trust and will not fear, what can flesh do to me? To you, O God, will I fulfil my vows. To you will I present my offerings of thanks. For you will deliver my soul from death and my feet from falling, that I may walk before God in the light of the living. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and shall be forever. Amen. Our first reading, we are still with the uh, prophet Isaiah, and this morning it is chapter 46. Bell bows down, Nebo stoops, their idols are on beasts and cattle. These things you carry are loaded as burdens on weary animals. They stoop, they bow down together, they cannot save the burden, but themselves go into captivity. Listen to me, O house of Jacob, all the remnant of the house of Israel, who have been born by me from your birth, carried from the womb, even to your old age I am he. Even when you turn grey, I will carry you. I have made and I will bear, I will carry and will save. To whom will you liken me and make me equal and compare me as though we were alike? Those who lavish gold from the purse and weigh out silver in the scales, they hire a goldsmith who makes it into a god. Then they fall down and worship, they lift it to their shoulders, they carry it, they set it in its place and it stands there. It cannot move from its place, if one carries out to it, it does not answer or save anyone from trouble. Remember this and consider, recall it to mind, you transgressors. Remember the former things of old, for I am God and there is no other. I am God and there is no one like me, declaring the end from the beginning and from ancient times things not yet done, saying my purpose shall stand and I will fulfill my intention, calling a bird of prey from the east, the man for my purpose from a far country. I have spoken and I will bring it to pass. I have planned, 
and I will do it. Listen to me, you stubborn of heart, you who are far from deliverance. I bring near my deliverance. It is not far off, and my salvation will not tarry. I will put salvation in Zion for Israel, my glory. And now for our canticle. That's the song of the wilderness. Lift up your voice with strength, O herald of good tidings. The wilderness and the dry land shall rejoice. The desert shall blossom and burst into song. They shall see the glory of the Lord, the majesty of our God. Strengthen, strengthen the weary hands and make firm the feeble knees. Say to the anxious, be strong, fear not. Your God is coming with judgment, coming with judgment to save you. Then the ears of the, then the eyes, then shall the eyes of the blind be opened and the ears of the deaf unstopped. Then shall the lame leap like a heart and the tongue of the dumb sing for joy. For water shall break forth in the wilderness and streams in the desert. The ransomed of the Lord shall return with singing and everlasting.